Yeah, it feels kind of um, so amazing you know, to come back to Panopoly Champion. It's something I've been you know, aiming for for so many years. Um, and to finally achieve it, it's just, yeah, I still can't quite believe it myself, really. <laughs> the results in Tokyo really exceeded my expectations. And the team event was, you know, was such an amazing one. I know how much, how, how much hard work, you know, me and these guys have put into this. And yeah, it really felt so amazing to come away with medals as a team, uh, not just as myself as well. I think, you know, one of the things um, I put our success down to is, you know, how much work we put in, in training and the way sort of the program in Bath has been working and, you know, um, really always looking for new ways to, to improve ourselves. Um, and as well with the team events, I think it really helps that we're such so close as a unit. Um, you know, these guys are my best mates and you know, we train here in Bath every day and hang out every day and I think that really helps that we're so close. The Tokyo Panopy experience was uh, very different to Rio. Um, I think culturally, the village, um, and of course uh, the biggest one of the coronavirus situation. So it was certainly very different. Um, but the most important thing was, yeah, the competition venue was very similar and it, it felt really special, like like, like it should for Panopy Games. Um, so yeah, although with no spectators it was different, it still felt a, you know, a really special event. I'm really hoping yeah, my team's success in, in Tokyo will really inspire more people to get into fencing. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm really hope that you know the sport can really grow bigger and bigger. And whether it's people just wanting to do wheelchair fencing as a hobby, or whether they decide to take it to Paralympic level, I, you know, I think it's a fantastic sport. And the more people that can get involved, the better. Really, I think that would be fantastic. Coming away from uh, Tokyo with five medals as a team uh, really was you know so, so special and. I think it's really exciting to see what we can do in Paris. Um, you know, more time, more athletes, more experience. Uh, so I think you're really the sky's the limit.